Hello there, this is Space Number 5. Welcome back to episode 10 of our Papal States Let's Play series, where we are currently at war with the Commonwealth, where we are going to try and release the Livonian Order, just so they don't cease to exist. And if we're lucky, maybe the Teutons as well, since we also would not want them to cease to exist in the near and distant future. As well, we want them as marches. So you guys left your friends alone in Transylvania and lost the Orgel. Okay, okay. Fair enough, guys. I understand that that is not necessarily the greatest goal. There we go. There goes Krakow. All right, we will go to Warsaw. Go ahead and siege there. Bulgaria is there to help us. Byzantium, why did you go over here when you were sieging here? Don't think that was necessarily the smartest choice there. Uh... <laughs> to be honest, Byzantium, you just caused your troops to die. Um, let's see. Transylvania, you're there. Decline to influence in... Oh, decline in influence. After losing the religious grip of more countries, our influence the defender of faith securely reduced. We have tier 4. Ah, that means Catholic lot left the league to reduce it. That kind of sucks. There is the Commonwealth Army right there, suffering attrition as they walk across their own land. That is perfectly fine with me. We do have quite a few troops. Actually, is a little concerning for us. But we'll just have to wait for Sweden, basically, to, to want to peace out. Over here, we are going to need to take this fort and then walk over here and basically occupy that province. And hopefully we'll be able to release them. At the very least, we need to release them just to reset the timer. Trade dispute against Austria, sure. Because that siege, let's go over here. Sweden is losing their war, it looks like. Pretty, uh, well, not horrendously. The capital is getting ready to fall, though. 55k stack, suffering 1.7 attrition as it roams the land. Byzantium, you're losing your army again. That's fine. Kind of wish you did more. And we'll take the three stab. Stab is nice. Especially going up to three stab. Let's see, we are out of manpower. We are 7,000 troops behind. You have quite a bit of money. For a thousand ducats, go ahead and continue to get our manpower up just a little bit. Alright. Lithuania is not an option. I don't particularly want to release any of these guys. So what we will do, I have to get all the way over here. I think this is lower development over here. <laughs> we will cut the Commonwealth in half, um, and then I probably want this province too. Oh, this is not the Teutons. This province will do. Do that. What's the difference in war score for these? Uh, that's a much smaller province than this guy. Okay, it's gonna take us quite a bit to go ahead and do that, but that shouldn't be that big of a deal. Come on back from Transylvania. Occupy there. You guys go ahead and occupy Transylvania. Not a big deal to us. That siege is good. Go ahead and go walk over to the next one. Sweden, you are on medium enthusiasm. We can actually piece you out. That'd be great. Negative 15 reasons. Fair enough. Your army is getting destroyed there by Denmark. And, well, we can, we can wait a little bit. And, okay, we have a Jubilee. That's fine. Manpower is staying relatively constant, which is okay with me. 1% tax, or 3% uh, basically, on our entire army is not so great. Mamluks have Separatists. That's fine. Not something we necessarily have to worry about. There's another Siege. Good. Sweden. Negative nine reasons, okay. Continue to walk forward. Quite a few negative reasons for that. Okay, fair enough. I will lose prestige because we're pretty much always capped. Cleanse the heresy on Cilia. Uh, well, that gives us a good, pr pretty good reason to go ahead and destroy you. Be honest about that one. Sweden, you're on six reasons. Your war exhaustion is going up and you're getting more and more occupied. Lost your capital. 
Really, no one's working on that siege. What are you doing, Denmark? Loose stab or no, we'll take the uh we'll take the religious rebels. They're Catholic anyway. We got five reasons still with Sweden. Yep, we're just gonna have to chill for that. And we'll let that slide, that's fine. Not the biggest of deals. Let's go ahead and do a little bit more occupations in the Commonwealth. Anyone else attack you guys, or is it just us? Just us. Yet another siege has fallen. Good. Sweden's at three reasons, two reasons. Yeah, we'll just have to wait for them to go to low. Continue to occupy land, it is going to let our manpower recover just a little bit, since we are uh, casually 13,000 um, off of where we would like to be. Or at least from positive. Where are you guys going? To Urbino. Why are you guys teleporting when you guys can just walk there? One of the many, many questions. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we are still occupying good. Sweden is at low. You can get out of this war. Appreciate you getting out. Alright, Commonwealth, you're going to get split. Take a thousand ducats from you. Coalition is... I mean, it's sizable, but it's not the worst thing in the world. Give us war ups. Give that back to Bulgaria. Oh, we're giving it to Moldavia, actually. Gotcha. Alright, Moldavia, you can have that. Doesn't cost me any any extra Diplo points, since it's already costing us quite a bit. At least anything. Not interested. Sure, give me the rest in cash. That'll do. Do you have any alliances I want you to break? Not really. We'll just take the money. Alright, we have a noodle now. <laughs> it is a long one. Um, we do have an open relationship slot, that's good. Gotta rival the Mamluks. <clears throat> Bulgaria is unhappy with us. Okay, be placated. We shall release the Livonian Order. Okay, so I can release you there. That's the Teutons, that's someone I want to release, yes. There you go, welcome. And then I would also like to release the Livonian Order, but it does not look like it is possible. Could release Lithuania though. Looks like they still have a lot of cores over here too. Yeah, we'll release Lithuania. I'll go ahead and release return this first though. Yep, we will return it. You'll go to Livonian Order. Welcome. You exist now once more. Lithuania. Welcome back. Honestly, releasing Galicia would also probably be pretty good. Guess a lot more cores we can return against the Commonwealth. Why don't we go ahead and convert this first, though? Oh, it's already Catholic. Perfect. We are going to go above our force limit. And go ahead and be released. There you go. Alright, vassals that need to be annexed. Transylvania, for sure. Really, you guys are all being disloyal? That's a little petty, guys. That, Lithuania, you are very petty right now. Alright, well, that is as good as it gets. Don't really need the devotion. Uh, we'll take it anyways, though. 
Alright, you guys can come on home. Let's go ahead and, I guess, take out Cilia, because they're doing something silly. Unintended. Lithuania, we need you to be happier with us. Yeah, we're currently losing two diplo points. That's fine for now. Venice joined the coalition. Alright, Venice, does that mean we just go and kill you now? I think that's what that means to us. Yeah, we'll do that. We can go that way. We can also go that way. That'll do. I'm sure you guys have military access. Coalitions continue to grow. Oh, the Ottomans are actually in that one as well. Well, we have reason to go fight you too. France. You would take an alliance if we were not at war. Hmm, I kind of regret my decision now. You have lots of money. Easily hire mercs. Can afford a 17k stack. I'll do. Go spawn over there in Rome. Improvement time reduction. People stay, sure. Platinum adjoining, sure. Again, not really that big of a deal to us at this point. Go defeat their armies, you go there. And you guys have very low morale. Are we actually going to win this fight? Yes, okay. Behind time on Diplotech, there is definitely an argument to go ahead and get our Diplotech a little bit higher. If you guys want to go hide over in, uh, in Venice, that's totally fine with me. Subjects go on Siege Focus. Excuse me, Moldavia, why are you upset? I understand you're the wrong religion, but Austria joined the coalition. That means it is Austria-Hungary. Or not Austria-Hungary. Austria... Ottomans, which is scary. They just go and break our siege on accident. Life goes on. Any conversions that we can do for anyone? No. Okay. We'll take Ancona back. And you guys just go sit in Treviso. Looks like we did go ahead and just stop the uh, coalition from continuing to form. It consists of Austria and the Ottomans. Which, I mean, is, is scary enough. Get ready to be capped on admin points. I'm gonna take admin. It does give us extra governing capacity. We're pretty much at the limit there anyways, so take it. And we'll go and state Genoa. Should be fine. We're gonna siege there. Manpower is still negative. 14,000. We're just kind of chilling, letting that recover. Austria is fabricating claims on us. Don't really particularly like that, but life goes on. Lithuania, you're being sieged. Moldavia's back underneath us, so we're just waiting on Lithuania to come back. Two tons, we could definitely make you a knights, or at least a... Uh, a march at this point. At least get half our objective, or a third of our objective done. Manpower is still recovering. We are getting 593 men a month. Small amount, but you know, every drop in the bucket does count towards filling it. Defender of the Faith once more. Uh, yeah, we'll take that from Austria. Oh no, you're the current curate controller. It's fine, you can keep it. Have prestige of at least 30. Gives us admin points. We'll take it. Gives the admin points. And Denmark, you are fighting Muscovy. That sucks. Why is it? Like, we just took it, and now we just have this negative <laughs> event right away. Not great. Be honest about that one. You're a little bit bigger than normal. Normally you stay as an OPM. So we are fighting Muscovy. We have a lot of allies. Take Neva. Oh, really? Not really interested in helping, <laughs> but <laughs> fighting Denmark. Yeah, Denmark, you're kind of losing. A... Make peace. At least take white peace with Sweden. They, they, they'll stay underneath you. That's my biggest suggestion to you. you. Guys, get out of here. 
Asha, you definitely don't like me. Bohemia, you do like me, though. You're threatened by me. I just reloaded the game and it's still bugged. Hmm, that's obnoxious. Well, Breska, good. This army definitely needs to get reinforced. Uh, let's not walk through our own army and suffer more attrition. We suffer enough attrition. Manpower is recovering, good, because we are using mercs to go and occupy land. That did fall. Oh, that's Osberg. I know their army's not involved. Let's see. Ship trade power propagation. We do have mercs right now. Let's go ahead and increase their discipline. Make them fight a little bit more. And we have a coalition war against Riga. The Pope. Oh, wow. Alright, Venice. I don't really want anything. I just want to make peace. Who is being disloyal? Lithuania is. Don't have any prestige, so we're just gonna chill. Ottomans did go ahead and attack us. Why is Riga the leader? <laughs> That's my big question. Um, well, there is an Austrian army there. This is a 3 4. Pretty good. I think we're just gonna defend uh, these little forts here. Call it good. Everything else is just kinda out there. Um, yeah. It's declined again, that's fine. I'm not gonna worry about it. These mercs probably need to get recalled. The coalition kind of is whatever at this point. Muscovy's gonna join the coalition? Oof. Well, we're already at war with them, so. Might as well take Verona. It'll be protected by this fort. Actually, I probably should have taken Presca because it is another mountain or a hill fort. Empire is recovering. Go be. Mm, be supportive now. I need your armies here. Can't piece anyone out, so we actually just have to win combats. Guys, wait a little bit. There we go. We can at least walk down here. So we might take combat down here over by Dal Dalmatia. Ottomans cannot cross at least, so that does kind of consolidate the realm a little bit, or at least prevent people from joining in unnecessarily. That's a capital, we can take that, Memington. It's not gonna be able to piece them out early, but at least help a little bit. Let's go take Spileto before they can take it. Just go try and combat. Do one of those actions. Let's see. Manpower. I think we're gonna have to lose our little bit of professional. Give us 18,000 troops. That is enough for, to reinforce all of our armies. You guys are fighting Muscovy. Not what I want to do, but being greedy sucks for sure. Land attrition reduction. We'll take that. It's hill, not a fort though. So we should have, oh no, it looks like Bulgaria lost 3,000 troops and that's worth so quite a bit of war score, more than what I would actually think it's worth, but oh well. Going for strolls. Is a mountain, we'll actually take on the uh, army of Memmington there. Not catch this little 2k stack like I would like to. Why don't you guys attach this army actually? Now it's an army of 40,000. This is farmland, we can actually take them there. Deleted that little 2k stack, good. Over here. We want to fight small armies, that's farmland, farmland. That will do. Come on over here, threaten the Ottomans, tell them to get back to the other side of the shore. There you go. Good, they broke the siege. Alright, let's go back to the north. Big combat? No, did not end up becoming a big combat. It's grassland, we can fight, go fight there. We're being blockaded, we don't care. Our entire goal is just to get white peace, honestly. Lots of claim on a province, that's fine. 
Because now we don't have any time stipulations. I guess we can occupy this, that's fine. We'll have to... Yeah, you guys are going to get occupied, that just is what it is. What is this? Mountains? No thank you. We'll take Bosnia back. We're going on the Siege of Memington so they can't form up any additional troops. Go occupy here. Manpower. About even, or at least we will be even. There we go. Come back over here. So we would like to go back to internal terrain. Denmark looks like you made peace. You're having f turtle fighting once more. They're not my vassals, good. Yeah, you guys go and siege that down, that's fine. It's not my land. Let's see. I'll go north here, relieve these the siege. Lithuania, you're fully occupied, which sucks, but it is what it is. Gonna occupy this. Celia is get, making claims, sure. Got that province at the very least. So we can do like small occupations. France, why are we at war together? Why are we allies? Oh, did you just join the war just to offset the uh, power? It will stay France. No, Austria is not. Are we actually allied? I don't think so. We are now, though. France, why did you come in? <laughs> that is, like, one of my biggest questions right now. Why are you here? <laughs> I'm not complaining, but I'm just going, huh? Alright, let's go help France with that siege. Uh, Alright, you guys left that siege. Good. Uh, yeah, we'll just go after the capital for a real quick. Getting our land back here. That's yeah, kind of whatever over there. Deal with that later. You need to go take out some of these small armies that are roaming. I'm going to go to Rigat. We are going to do an artillery barrage there, just because that is going to be very important. Getting their capital occupied. You're going to attack my va my uh, my vassal's land. We'll just destroy you. Okay, apparently you're a little bit fast on us. The navy got destroyed. Uh, are you not going home during war? Answer is no. Kind of thought it was. All right, another victory. Let's go crush the Austrians here. They're going. Got that fort. Good. Let's go over to the Platinet. Is there anyone that we can peace out with? Ham Bremen and Hamburg are the only ones. Gotcha. Not what I want to hear, but it's what it is. Jilly Barrage. Good use for our military points, I think. Austrian army getting destroyed there. We are losing more than what we are killing. That sucks. Let's come on down here and just be threatening. Just go over here to pose a threat. Be expected, losing diplo points. It sucks. Losing 4,000 troops and, like, 3,000 troops should not be worth as much war score as it is. We're talking, like, these are supposedly the big events, or big fights. I can go take up the, uh... Ooh, if you guys are actually going to catch them. They... Oh, you did catch them. Good job, S Serbia there. Full, full kill. Uh, you guys are sitting there. I don't really like that, though. We are looking for white piece. Negative 40 reasons. Okay. Occupying here. 
That's Muscovy, so I don't really care about that. Shift consolidate real quick. Go go in. I don't see a real reason not to. Gotta defend Constantinople, so. And we're gonna lose that fight. That sucks. Oh, they had better. Actually, fire is not the most important. Lost 12,000 troops there. It's a little overkill, I think. Do some more manpower. That did hurt us quite a bit. Never mind, it's not even counted. That's oh, right here. Minus four, four war score. That sucks. There goes Riga. Good. Let's go and help Lithuania out a little bit. This siege will help. France is working on that siege. Good. Negative 40 reasons. Well, it is going in the right direction. For the most part. Let's go ahead and just walk right there. Just so you can reinforce a little bit quicker in our own terrain. Oh, we accidentally hit the Papal States. Oh, they're gone. Ship consolidate? Who's gonna be the aggressor? Oh, we are. Yay, in the hills. Alright, go take that. Oops. <laughs> we have accidentally sent the army in to continuously fight. Not what we want to do. Uh, you just go ahead and walk out. Minus three war score, that sucks. No help there. Thought France was going to win that siege. It was already at 49%. Alas, they did not. I would like white peace, honestly. This war is not going on long enough. Transylvania, I would love to annex you at this point, but no such luck. Let's see. Negative seven reasons. That siege is gone. That sucks. It's what it is. And we lose stab. Even better. Top of a coalition where we have a... Uh... <laughs> uh... Oh, you became Spain now. Congratulations, Spain. You have combined your unions. Or I guess concluded your union. Or over. Bremen, you're not fully occupied. Got rebels, though. Hamburg, I would actually piece you out, preferably. You're not ready, so I guess we'll just have to occupy it. Is what it is. Transylvania's getting ready to fall. Negative nine reasons. There goes another siege, good. France, you're going to go work on that siege. I guess we'll walk over, just because these are mercs. Just to make sure we get that siege done and over with. 64%. Do and it fell. Yeah, I guess we go to the capital of Vienna. Negative zero reasons. I don't really care about making the clergy happy, to be honest. It is not on the, my forefront. Oh, you're on medium enthusiasm now. We can actually take stuff. Not that I'm going to, but actually I kind of want that. Yeah, give me that. <laughs> give me this so I can walk all the way around. That's so bad, taking land in a coalition war. <laughs> but it's mine. Um, how are we going to supposed to help here? Honestly, I don't really care if Denmark loses, so we're just going to go home. We've done our job. You're on medium enthusiasm. Yeah. All right. You guys need a drill. Lost a claim, that's fine. You guys go home. Wow, that leader is awful. 3020. Oh, aggressive expansion reduction. That's actually pretty nice. Commonwealth, what is our truce up? Because we're going to be fighting you. You're attacking the Livonian Order again. Give us that. 
But that is all the time I have for today. If you enjoyed today's episode, please like and subscribe. Have a wonderful day.